Hey boys and girls, welcome to our CM lunch break. I'm Miss Marin and uh, we have a special guest today and it is Miss Gabby. Everyone say hi. Hi. Well today for our CM lunch break we are going to be talking about a refuge. What is a refuge? I'm glad you asked Miss Gabby. Well a refuge is just a safe place that you can go to when a storm hits, whether it's a tornado or even a rainstorm. Well, good thing we don't need one today because <gasps> it is just such a beautiful day. Yeah, I such love a it. beautiful day. The sun is okay. or our own safe place and we built a little cardboard box for us to do our CM lunch break in for today. So today we are talking about what we discussed earlier, a refuge or a safe place. And we're going to be reading out of our devotion for today. And this is what God says to us about him being our refuge. So listen up. A refuge is a safe place, a place to take shelter when storms come your way. I am your refuge. Storms aren't just rain, thunder, and lightning. They aren't just wind and hail or snow. They can also be worries, doubts, unkind words, problems at school, or troubles with parents or friends. No matter what storm you're facing, I will be your safe place, your refuge. Be merciful to me, God. Be merciful to me because I come to you for protection. I will come to you as a bird comes for protection under its mother's wing. When worries and fears creep into your thoughts, don't turn to the TV, the computer, the cell phone, or your favorite food. Turn to me. Keep a cool head. Stay alert. The devil is ready to pounce and would like nothing better than to catch you napping. Think about me and my promises to always be with you and take care of you. When you choose to think about me instead of your worries, you will find your shelter in my presence but it won't happen all by itself. You have to choose me over your worries. When you do, your worries won't seem so worrisome anymore. There is joy for those who take refuge in me. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Oh, the joys of those who take refuge in him. Do you guys have a safe place? Somewhere you can go when you're feeling overwhelmed or worried or sad? My safe place is my bedroom. I go there when I feel overwhelmed. And sometimes I just sit there, I'll pray, read the Bible, or even journal. What's your safe place, Marin? My safe place is also my bedroom. I like to sit on my bed and do a lot of the similar things that Gabby does. I also like to turn on some worship music and just close my eyes and just allow God to speak to me. So boys and girls, we encourage you to find a safe place if you don't already have one, whether that be your bed or your reading corner or even outside in your backyard next to your favorite tree. Um, but it's just some place that you can always go to when you are feeling overwhelmed or tired and you can just rest in God's presence. Yep. So today we encourage you to say this prayer when you're in your quiet or when you're in your safe place. God, I invite you into my safe place because you are my refuge. I give my worries to you and receive your joy. Thank you for always being with me and taking care of me. I love you. Amen. Amen. And we will have that in the emails that we send out to the parents so you guys can always refer back to that prayer. Well, that is it. And uh, we hope that you guys are able to build your own fort and your own refuge. And make sure you send us a picture. You can email it to rock. Um, to cm at rockofroseville.com or you can text the picture to Miss Julie. But until next time, bye guys! Bye!